So as some of you may know, I've been working behind the scenes with BBTFRG and especially Aaron, helping them get their YouTube channel switched over to PC streaming and back up and going to the amazing extent that they have got it today. I mean, I, and I didn't do all of it. I just, you know, taught them how to use Streamlabs and, you know, a little bit of tips as far as uh, YouTube goes and some things that YouTube has recently implicated and, you know, they're always changing things. Just little things like that, but mainly just, you know, teaching Streamlabs. And in payment for that, or I told him he didn't have to, but he wanted to, you know, repay me for my help. And he sent me, a, uh, I'd say a little care package, but no, this is a, a pretty large care package that he sent almost halfway across the world to me to give a thank you to me. And I want to let you know, Aaron, thank you, sir. You have done amazing things with... BBTFRG, all of y'all have, as far as, you know, you, Callum, um, Martin, all y'all guys are doing a fantastic job with YouTube channel, with everything y'all do in BBTFRG. It's one of the biggest places out there as far as Boone Beach is concerned for, you know, all the knowledge y'all give, all the recruitment all that stuff and if anybody wants to check them out i'm definitely putting y'all's link in the comments as well as some more information but without further ado let's go ahead and get into checking out what aaron has sent me because i only know i think one maybe two items that are in here just because they were slightly customized he wanted to get my opinion on doing that and i did go ahead and remove the lid uh, it had like my address and stuff on it, so I just cut it off, but I haven't taken the bubble wrap off, so you'll get my re reaction as we go through each item. And I will say, he does tape things up very well, so I um, did bring me some scissors, because I'm not really sure how involved it's going to be getting into each package, it is the lid, getting the lid off was quite a feat in itself. So we're going to go ahead and remove the first layer of bubble wrap. Uh, there it goes. <laughs> Second layer of bubble wrap. And I'm not sure how this stuff is placed. So let me... Yeah, this is going to be on top. So this will be the first thing we open. Wrapped all nicely in bubble wrap. And as several of you know, you probably know what some of these items are. Because, you know, he does have the 3D printer that he uses. So I'm sure that in the prize giveaways and everything that... Sorry, I gotta focus. Hang on, I'm gonna end up cutting myself. I'm trying to talk at the same time. <laughs> you know, he's got all the prize give giveaways they do and every awesome... 3D printed magic that he's able to create is really truly amazing. So let's see. Item number one. Gonna be very careful here. Don't want to break anything. Oh. Oh, wow. One of his, I saw it posted in the uh, group. It looks way cooler in person, I'm not going to lie. That's amazing. Here's for y'all to see. Supercell's logo, and he's added the artillery, the Boom Beach artillery right there on top. That is... Sick! That is awesome, Aaron. That turned out really well. I know he had said this is that he had some issues with making this, but if I have anything to say about it, I think you have perfected it. Because I think he was just starting to make this as he sent this package off, so I'm glad that was able to get in there. That's really cool. It'll make a very nice ornament on the desk right here. 
And let's see, what is next? Now, I do see some t-shirts in the bottom of here, so that's exciting. Oh, judging by the shape, I think I know what this one is. Let me just go ahead and get some scissors and be very careful with this tape. Yep, there we go. Open it very carefully. Let's toss that over there. It's a, it's a power core. I've always wanted one of these. He's known that. That's amazing. It's, uh, yeah, that's one of the, looks like one of the glow-in-the-dark power cores that he makes so this actually if you leave it in the sunlight will turn will glow green just like the power cores do in boom beach that is so cool man that looks awesome those turn out so well like a lot of times 3d printing can be pretty tedious because you'll have like little tiny imperfections here and there but i'm not seeing any imperfections he's really taking his time making sure these things are top notch so for those of you that haven't seen it the power core i'm gonna need to make some more room here i kind of scoot all this back a little bit i'm gonna move my scissors all right let's see up oh, next and yeah, I know y'all are all getting jealous right now. Trust me, I would be too. I'm so excited that he was he did this for me. Just goes to show what, what kind of awesome person Aaron is for doing this. He truly is a amazing person. One of the nicest guys you'll meet. Known him for years and never had a bad thing to say about him. Although, I will say, he uses too much tape. <laughs> no, I don't blame you, though. I would use that much tape, too, for what's in these. Don't want anything getting broken, especially how far you had to ship it, which, wow. Kudos. And I think I completely missed that piece of tape there. There we go. Man, I'm going to have quite the collection. I am so excited right now. Like, I'm ecstatic. These are uh, freaking amazing. Oh, it's the Warrior. Heck yeah, I was hoping I was going to get a Warrior. One of my favorite troops. The best, best troop to clear your map with is this guy right here. You get a load out of them, especially now with the HQ-24, and you can load more of these bad boys. That is really cool. That's just so cool how how well they turn out like that. I mean, he's got like his pecs are there. Like he got the full detail of the hammer. You've got his uh, hair back there is looking. Even the earring is wow. That's very detailed. And y'all will get a picture of these later once I get them. Uh, out in some sunlight, it's actually dark here right now, so that will be at a later date, but that is really cool. 3D printed warrior, that is so exciting. Now, if only he could perfect the Zooka. <laughs> I'm just messing with you, Aaron. I, I know that's a, a soft subject. The Zuka will come. They're just... Zuka's being rather difficult, as she always likes to be. <laughs> Let me try and find the tape on this one. Ah, 
there we go. Okay, trying to get a little bit of separation in there. I don't want to damage any of the items. I just want the tape. Oop, looks like we got a little bit more tape there. There we go. Another really cool fact is these things came all the way from the other side of the ocean. That's just really cool. One day I'm going to get over there and visit y'all. That's for, that's for certain. Oh, now between this and the power core, this might be my favorite course. I don't know what and all else is left in here. <laughs> oh, wow. That really turned out. That font is amazing. It's a gunboat, and this one is the one that I was talking about earlier that is custom. See, it says, try and get it to where y'all can view it. There it goes. SS Rogue Flare, which was Aaron had put in the group, uh, don't remember how long ago, maybe a couple weeks, maybe longer, maybe less. Um... Basically having everybody come up with their own name for the gunboat that he was printing. And there were several really good comments. And mine was the SS Rogue Flare. And so he asked me what I wanted to name it. And I said, well, let's go with that. That was my favorite one. At least out of my comments. Now, there were some other good ones. I, I liked how the vote went. I definitely agreed with how that came out. But wow, that looks really cool. Even like the gun is hollow right there like it would act on both sides like it would actually be able to shoot something and the rocket launchers wow even the cross on the top just looks top quality top quality i'm gonna set that right there and let's see we got some excess bubble wrap looks like one more item Oh, I see some metal. I think I know what this one is. If I can get this tape to work with me. There we go. I was hoping to get one of these. If not, I was gonna buy it with some uh, critter coins. It's the artillery keychain, the Boom Beach artillery with the keychain. That looks amazing. It's like the same artillery that they've got on this, that he put on the uh, Supercell logo. You've got it as a keychain. So freaking cool. The ideas this guy comes up with are just amazing. I mean, it's even got the little imprint of the access door on it. That's really cool. Let me get this bubble wrap out of the way. And we'll set this over here. Man, I collect it almost like Aaron. No, not quite. <laughs> well, man, thank you so much. I'm so excited. Okay, now we have a t-shirt. Oh, I'm so excited. Oh, the BBT. Oh, that's my favorite print, too. That's my favorite logo. BBTFRG. Heck yeah. 
Aaron, you are awesome. I can't thank you enough for all this. This is truly above and beyond what... And I mean, I didn't even want payment trying to help you. And this has gone above and beyond... You know, what I what little I did, really. I mean, I did... You know, we spent some time together. But overall, like, thank you so much. I can't... I can't thank you enough. But if anybody wants to get a part of any of these keychains, you can actually win or... Um, just get these keychains by watching BBTFRG's YouTube channel. I will have a link to their YouTube channel. And basically just by watching their videos and being in there, being active with them, you can earn critter coins and whatnot and be able to get you one of these little keychains if you're interested in that. If you're interested in some of these other things, like this here gunboat, you can uh, enter in some of their giveaways. They have several giveaways that they do. All, I mean, they're always giving stuff away. Aaron's all about, you know, helping the next guy and getting people free stuff. So definitely check them out. Same with the Warrior. You can get that as well by being a part of their YouTube channel and being a part of their Facebook page. Both of those will be in the comments. All of these things you can win in their giveaways. So definitely, if you want any of it, Check them out, send Aaron a message, send somebody a message in there, just post in the group, post in a comment on the YouTube channel. They'll get you sorted out. They're great people. And thank you again, Aaron. I really do appreciate it.